everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope this day finds you well and rested and making the most of it. If you are completely new here and like lifestyle and luxury and skincare product reviews and planning and organization, this channel is for you. So click that little red subscribe button. And while you're at it, you should follow me over on Instagram. I'll leave my handle right here. We have a lot of fun over there. I answer every single comment and question and we're building a really great community. So, if you've watched any of my videos, you know that a couple weeks ago, Estee Lalonde did a review on the Crabtree and Evelyn's La Source collection. I watched her review, and she got me feeling all sorts of ways about it. So on that very same day, I ran out and bought several pieces from the La Source collection, and I have been using them religiously. And let me tell you, I absolutely love every single product. I'm gonna go ahead and keep this short and sweet and dive into the 10 products I have from the Source collection. I will leave them linked all down below if you are interested. And by all means, ask any questions you have in the comments below and I will make sure to get back to you. But let's go ahead and dive on in. The first is the Refreshing Body Wash. Now, I have no way to describe this scent except that it literally smells like the beach. I know that there are many things that are like, it's beach scented, and you're like, uh, I don't know. I don't know how Crabtree and Evelyn did it, but they literally captured the beach in the bottle. Like everything you think about when you go, it's in here. And I cannot explain it, except that like, I feel like it's salty and fresh and clean, and it smells like waves, and I just don't know how they did it, but it is such a unique fragrance and it's just beautiful. This body wash is also really nice. It foams up really, really well, rinses off really cleanly, leaving no residue behind. I really like it. It's becoming one of my favorite body washes. It's fabulous. The next, and this is almost completely gone because I love it so much, and this is the Exfoliating Body Scrub with Fine Pumice. How I use this is before I use the body wash, I simply put this in my hands. I rub my legs, rub my arms, rub my shoulders, I rub my hands together on my neck, chest, all over, and the Fine Pumice is so fine that it's not super abrasive. It does the job of getting your smooth... It does the job of getting your skin really smooth without feeling too harsh. I know many of you have tried those apricot scrubs that feel really harsh and the texture is really, really sharp. This isn't like that. This is very finely grained pumice. I love this stuff. And after I use this, I feel like my skin is so ready to accept the other products that I put on on top. I have seen such a difference in my skin texture and how smooth everything is. And I have been using this at least four times a week. That is why it is down to here. The scent is different from the rest of them. This one has like a peppermint scent, which is really invigorating, but it doesn't clash with the other scent of the La Source line, which is that beachy smell. It goes with it really nicely, but this is really nice, especially in the morning. The scrub wakes you up and the scent. It's very energizing. This fine pumice scrub is a great thing to have in your bath routine. The next body scrub I'm going to talk about is actually a bar of soap. And it is a bar of soap that has these little nubs all over it that massage your skin. And there's also like a fine pumice grain in this as well. So as you're scrubbing, you get the massaging, the exfoliating of the scrub, and also this foams up beautifully. And I'll tell you, I have this one, the nubs are no longer there, but it's still just as relaxing, just as wonderful without the nubs, but I will tell you there's power in the nub. So I really, really love this. As far as this scent, this does really smell like a bar of soap. When you think of like that Lever 2000 or that Dove scent, that is what this has. It's super relaxing. And I will tell you, out of all the bar of soaps I've ever used, this one just naturally foams up a lot and I really like it. It leaves no film on your skin. It rinses off really cleanly. I love these and I feel so relaxed. When you run this like over your calves after a workout and over your arms and shoulders, it automatically sets you up for a really great night. The next scrub that we're going to talk about is the Miracle Moisturizing Hand Scrub. I have completely changed my hand skincare game because of the Crabtree and Evelyn La Source collection. This hand scrub is by far the best hand scrub that I have ever, ever used. Now, unlike the fine pumice, this one's definitely a lot grainier, which your hands can take because they're not as sensitive. 
I have seen such a difference around my cuticles and just the palms of my hands are so soft. I use this every single morning when I wake up to wash my hands and then I use the hand soap afterwards and I just really love it. Once again, the scent of this is very much aligned with the body wash. It has that beachy smell that I cannot articulate, but it literally smells like you're walking down the beach. This hand scrub is really great for this time of year when your hands are dry and just getting over the winter. So I highly recommend this and it will make your hands feel buttery soft and people will notice. So after I'm done using the scrub, I then use the conditioning hand wash. This has that same beachy smell, foams up really nice, cleans off, rinses up, rinses off really nicely. It's a great hand soap. I actually have two bottles of these and I think Crabtree and Evelyn are running a deal. If you spend so much, you get a free one. So you should definitely go check them out. Since we talked all about scrubs and body washes, now we're gonna talk about moisturizing and hydrating your skin. And the nightly hand moisturizer I have been using in cahoots with the hand scrub and the conditioning hand soap is the La Source Overnight Hand Therapy. This stuff is the best. A lot of overnight hand therapy moisturizers end up being like an oily ointment that is super thick and heavy. And like you go to bed and you're like, I don't want to touch anything because your hands almost feel slimy. This soaks in so wonderfully. It is so creamy and buttery and the smell is unbelievable, but I think along with the scrubbing I've been doing, this has really helped around my cuticle area. I make sure to rub it in really well there, and I have seen that dry skin that I normally get almost completely vanish between the scrubbing and the moisturizing. I keep this tube on my bedside table and put it on every night after I'm done reading my book, and I love it. The next is the hydrating body lotion. What can I say? It soaks in really well, doesn't leave you oily, doesn't leave you feeling like you've just put on tons of lotion. It dries down quick, it soaks in, it absorbs, and it has that same amazing scent. I use this as soon as I step out of the shower in the morning, um, just to make sure I'm really nicely moisturized for the day and ready to rock and roll. This is a wonderful body moisturizer. The scent is amazing and it just really balances out the whole collection. And it's just such a nice addition after you got that scrub and exfoliating on your skin to back it up with a moisturizer with the same scent is just so calming and so relaxing and a beautiful start to your day. This is my morning moisturizer and I'm gonna to talk to you now about what I've been using to hydrate my skin after my bath at night. This is the Hydra Marine Nourishing Oil. I have had a disastrous situation with this. I took this traveling because I was driving and I dropped this on a stone floor and it shattered and I literally was heartbroken because let me tell you, this oil is the most hydrating thing I've ever put on my skin and it has the same beachy, perfect scent. It really is perfect. And what I love about this oil the most, A, it comes as a spray but it's very much a dry oil. It soaks in super quick. And I've always shied away from oils, but this has made me a true believer in it. I wake up in the morning and I not only feel so smooth, but I literally smell like I just got done surfing, which I've never surfed in my life. And what else I've been doing this is spraying a little bit of my hand and running it through the ends of my hair just to really keep my hair hydrated. So in the morning when I shower, I wash that all out and I've seen a really great difference in the texture of my skin. I love this oil. I use it every single day and you will not regret purchasing it, I promise. The last thing I'm going to talk about is the refreshing body mist. I use this after my showers and I use this after my baths. This is more of a perfume or body spray, and I think out of all the pieces in the collection, this is the least necessary because the other ones are truly making a difference with my skin. For this, I just love the fragrance so much that the more I can smell it, the happier I am. I spray this on my bathrobe, I have sprayed this on my pillow, I spray it on myself. I absolutely love it, and it is a fantastic fragrance that is super unisex, and it's just, 
wonderful. So that is my review of the La Source collection from Crabtree and Evelyn. It is by far one of my favorite collections from a skincare line. Not only are the products doing great things for my skin, but the scent literally transports you onto a vacation. If you like this video, make sure you click subscribe and also go catch me over on Instagram. I'll leave my handle one more time right here at the bottom of the screen. In the meantime, I will leave this video like I leave all of my videos. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free, my friends. Give it to everyone. Until next time, bye-bye.